President Theodore Roosevelt once said that comparison is the thief of joy. And when I heard that the other day, I thought YouTube, social media space, when it comes to the lawn care industry or lawn tube, as we all hear and know what it is. So I just wanted to talk about that here today. Let's get started. Man, that applies to the social media lawn tube space or the, the lawn care space more perfectly, in my opinion. I heard that on a, a, a DIY candle makers channel the other day. I've been following him for a while now. I used to be into the DIY candle making. I actually wanted to turn it into a business at one point, but it's just a very saturated uh, community, a very saturated business. And I just enjoy doing it at home myself now. And I, I still follow the guy. He's a great follow. But when I heard that the other day, I was just like, wow. And you guys know, you know what I think of the lawn tube, the social media space, the Instagram, the TikTok space. It's just, it's just an info commercial anymore. And, um, and leading into that info commercial, you know, you just see all these videos of these perfect lawns. And guys, there's a lot of people out there that don't even show their lawns at this point in the year. I mean, we're in the fall time. You're seeing videos out there from people from their springtime and their summertime. I mean, and it's just like, it, and in my opinion, when it says, when, when comparison is a thief of your joy, I just think, yeah, it makes you depressed sometimes. Not me, but I know it probably de deters people from doing stuff to their lawn because they see these perfect lawns and people aren't even being transparent out there with you when they're showing off their reels and their rate, their stripes and their, you know, their, you know, is this a one to 10 kind of thing? Because they're not even showing you what their lawn really looks like today. So yeah, it is a feat of your joy comparing your lawn to someone else's lawn don't get don't get discouraged discouraged from it because everyone is different everyone has their ups and their downs and some people they don't like showing their ups and their downs they only like showing their ups and that just takes away from your enjoyment because you think oh man their lawn's perfect all the time what are they doing to their lawn they they never have a bad day in their life with the, with their lawn but in reality they probably do and they're just not showing you it because one they don't want you to see it because they want you to think that they are perfect two they're compromised by some sort of uh, you know affiliate marketing and you know their lawn has to be perfect for that affiliate marketing because if their lawn looked like shit then probably people would be discouraged from either their the products or what that person's doing to their lawn so really when it comes down to it don't don't compare yourself with other people just do you just you know this it's just grass at the end of the day it's just grass I mean and when I talk about my you know you guys know I put out a ton of a ton of content on Instagram and TikTok a lot and I do my YouTube short reels now and I just do it because I like to give people a little laugh a little joy in their life you know if I can make someone laugh from one of my reels or, you know, whatever I'm doing, that's all that really matters when it comes down to it for me. And I hope it comes across that way to you guys at home. All I really want people to get out of watching this video today is just to be transparent with people. And, you know, don't steal that joy away from people because your lawn probably isn't always perfect. And show them the ups and the downs and don't be discouraged from showing you know real-time pictures of your lawn and and showing them pictures of the spring and the summertime we're not there anymore guys we are in the fall time and you guys know going into the fall oversee time my lawn looked like hell it looked bad I mean it was even going into the fall overseed and continuing once I put down my grass seed it still looked bad because I did something that I learned from I put too much water on top of my grass seed drowned out probably most of the seed and I had to put down additional seed but I wasn't afraid to show that it, I wasn't embarrassed by it because you live and you learn you show your ups and your downs and that's why that so, this social media sometimes it's good sometimes it's bad and again there's no one's perfect out there I by all means I am not perfect in any way those celebrities out there that seem like they're perfect they're not perfect the ones that flaunt their politics around like they know what they're talking about they're not perfect half these youtubers that we watch 
they're not perfect either. Half these lawn care people aren't perfect either. That's all I really want to get out of this video. So one more time, guys. Comparison is the thief of your joy. And when you watch other lawn tubers out there today or other social media or TikTok that's related to lawn care, think about that quote in the back of your mind. And think about whether they're being transparent with you on what they're showing. And don't get it, don't let it discourage what you're doing in your lawn. Because again, no one's perfect. If you agree or don't agree with me, please comment below. And if you enjoyed today's video, make sure you smash that like button. It really does help out with the channel. And if you're interested in any of my other content, I'm available on Instagram. I'm available on TikTok. Go check me out there. And like always, guys, I'll see you in the next one.